I could use some wires to connect that. Simple ones would do. Nicole, think. I could use a short piece of wire. Depends on what you have in mind. I have to dig around in my laptop a bit. How about a hair clip? I have a few lying around. Oh, that's perfect. Thank you. No problem. I'm going upstairs. Have a nice evening. Yeah, you too. Please come back in a moment. Dinner is almost ready. It's one of those useful little things that women always carry around with them. These two pieces of the clip should fit into the plug. No connection to the antenna. Now our specialist will take care of the pictures. Hello? New York FBI office, how can I help you? Ruth? You still at work? It's Nicole. I have a request. Oh, it's you, honey. Where are you, in the jungle? Very funny. I'm in Paris. Oh, right. I can see some pictures coming through from Paris. They're from me. What should I do with them? Give them to Nick. Have him take a look. You're out of luck. He's gone for longer. As usual. Well, give them to Fred then. Ask him to compare them with the materials on the puppeteer case. All right. Any specific hints? No. The position and attachment of the body, the broken mirror, the imprint on the glass, he'll know. When are you coming back? Soon, I guess. There's not much I can do here. In Paris? You can party all night long. How's my cat? Perfectly fine, which can't be said about my refrigerator. Thanks. Bye. Bye-bye. Inspector Petty. Nice to hear you. Did the officer deliver the evidence? Yeah, thank you. We'll analyze it. If I could draw your attention to the... Maybe later. The brass has asked me to pass on some news. Yes? We've got another murder. Looks like the same perp. Where? On Montmartre. I'll go there then, okay? Whatever suits your fancy. You'll have to find it on your own, though. Rue de Nouveau, 513. All right. Thank you for the call. Good night, mademoiselle.
The door is locked. It must be really late. That's a good idea. I'll just rent a car. A rental car advert. Maybe they have something roadworthy. Yes, may I help you? I can't sleep. Jet lagged, you know. If I wanted to take a walk around the area, what would you recommend I see? Hmm, at this hour, the Place du Tertre. Oh, the artist square. More like tourists, but it does have a nice atmosphere. Artists draw portraits for a few euros. Ah, <laughs> it's a waste of time. I don't know. You're so pretty, they'll be climbing over one another just to draw you. Give Maybe I should rent a car. I won't have to call cabs all the time. Are you going somewhere else afterwards? I don't know yet. Driving around the city during the day is not a good idea. You should take the subway or the bus. But it shouldn't be a problem at this time of day. Provided you can find a parking space. Either way, I'd like to have it now. Oh la la, it's late. There's no way I'll find you one now. Well, make it tomorrow then. All right, all right. Could you call me a cab? But of course, but what about dinner? Just put it in the fridge for me. It won't be as tasty if it is reheated. Oh well. Henri? C'est Pierre Montagnac. Please send a cab to my hotel. Yes, straight away. Merci. The cab will be here shortly. Great. Thanks. That's all. I don't need that mode of transportation. Didn't let you go, eh? And I was already halfway out the door. The old man must hate me. You're not the only one. And he's not the only one to hate me either. Those criminals love to make us work weekends. What do you know about the victim? It's a girl. She was a regular here. Why can't men just stick to murdering each other? Any evidence? I'm telling you the inspector was gobsmacked when he saw how much you collected there. I can imagine. But I'm asking about this murder here. Say memo. Like the puppeteer? Whose apartment is that? Wong Jack Dupree, a countryman of yours. The neighbor heard a quarrel in this apartment today. That's very interesting. Have you brought him in yet? You'll have to ask the inspector about the details. Except I think he's busy now. Is that know-it-all here? Send her up here. I'll come by at a later time. It looks like a toolbox. I may find something useful in it. A locker filled with rubbish. I'm here, Inspector. What's a beautiful woman like you doing here? You should be enjoying the delights of Paris rather than snooping around holes like this one. Thank you for your concern, but I already took a walk along the Montmartre. 
Oh, you needn't have. We'll mail you all the data you asked for. Well, since I'm already here, how about you tell me something about the suspect? Sure, he's an American by the name of Jack Dupree. How long has he been here? Several weeks. Fits with your puppeteer. We'll have to check the dates. Any evidence? Fingerprints? Yes, they're being compared right now. So, who's the victim? Jacqueline Lorraine, another dancer. This time from the Moulin Rouge. Judging by the hooks and ropes, her body was arranged too. He hung her up above the floor as if she were doing a grand jeté. Just there, where the blood stain is. Blood? Well, that doesn't sound like the puppeteer. He always prepares his victims meticulously. Well, he could have taken a shortcut this time. You think these psychos are some sort of divine creatures? But they sometimes lose control of the situation. I know what I'm talking about. I've seen it up close. What about the doll? Did he leave a doll? No, but most probably someone startled him. Do you have a witness? Yes, a woman living in this building. Did she witness the murder? No, but we've got the killer in our grasp anyway. Can I be present at his interrogation? Do you really want to sit around with us in those stuffy rooms? Yes, I do. Well, you know, we haven't exactly caught him yet, but it is a matter of hours. It's very important to us. We need to be sure whether or not he's the puppeteer. You will be. We'll squeeze him like a lemon. Can I count on you calling me? Like now? I'll try. But it's easy to forget when you're swamped with work like me. Of course, I can contact your superiors directly, but it's not quite the same as talking to a colleague who works in the field. See, I'm going back to the States. I want to have something substantial for my boss. He must be driving you hard, too. I can see it in your haste and your insistence. I knew you'd understand. After all, neither of us is sitting in a cozy cafe right now. I hope we'll have the opportunity to get to know each other better on private grounds. Yes, professional contacts distort true human relations. Please, take my card. The design is lovely, isn't it? Oh, yes. Thank you. If not now, maybe next time. I'm sure I'll come back to visit. I love France. My father comes from here. Really? Ah, that explains your French surname. My father can talk about French cuisine and wine for hours. I could feel you weren't born under the sign of the hot dog. And I could feel you had brilliant intuition. Just forget about the case for a moment. Go to a good restaurant. Enjoy life like you would a fine dinner. As you can see, not everybody lives to see the main course. Can I take a look around? There's no need. This time we really did check everything thoroughly. Oh, no. That's not what I... We'll send you all the files, but stop nosing about here for now. Will you let me know if something happens? Take my advice. Forget about the case for a while. Michelle Petty, police inspector. Don't touch anything, please.